What up? I'm Jade Johnson, a New Orleans-based collage artist, and these videos are where I'm going to share weeks of my life as a creative person and my creative thoughts with you. It's also an extension of my newsletter from the desk of Jade Johnson, which you can find on Substack. Alright, so if you know me, you know that I've got to be real with y'all. Lately, I've been feeling the call to expand my art practice somehow. I wasn't exactly sure in what way, but in reflecting on it, I've been an illustrator for 11 years, a children's illustrator to be specific, and I've been feeling the need to step back, to take the time and space to figure out who I really want to be in this new era of my creative life. Uh, and so I've been expanding my practice into pottery. I've dabbled in pottery a few times over the years, mostly during the height of the pandemic, but I haven't been able to practice it consistently until maybe two months ago. Many, many parts of the process, particularly the sculpting process, still feels really awkward and foreign to me, but in a way that's also new and refreshing. Kind of being uncomfortable in an environment that I'm already comfortable in, if that makes sense. In the clips you'll have just seen, I'm working on three geese, goose, goose ring holders. <laughs> and it's just an idea that I've had in my head for a while that I thought would be uh, really cute as a functional ceramic piece. They were originally ducks, then swans, and now geese. <laughs> and I think, I think it's fitting. They are what they were always meant to be. This was the underglaze phase and I think they came out great. Now it's just to wait for the firing um, behind the scenes. I've already seen them and they came out great. Can't wait to share them with you. Before we jump into some collaging, I just want to remind you that I have a newsletter. I've only mentioned it a million times, but my newsletter is from the desk of Jay Johnson where you can get more behind the scenes goodies. Look at all these goodies that you're missing. So subscribe if you want to. If you're already subscribed to my newsletter, you will have seen these collage bits. Um, but I just wanted to talk more about it because in addition to pottery, I still have a deep love for collage. It's been revolutionary to my art practice, but also the fleshy human parts of me that just crave tactile stimulation. There's never a dull moment with collage and it's really just given me a slow concentrated way to process my thoughts and my feelings. The past few months, I've begun to think of collage as less of a way to stand out, to get hired, and more of the fine art practice that it's kind of always been. There's so much that I want to learn, so many subjects and themes I want to explore that I can't really do through only client work, especially children's work. Through my newsletter, I'm stretching myself to do that while also taking my time with it, just enjoying being on my own schedule for once. <laughs> Thank you. 
While you enjoy watching me sort through my collage scraps, I'm going to talk more about how I'm using documentation as an art form on my newsletter. So if you're interested in that or just want to see more behind the scenes stuff, catch up with me there. It's, it's going to be a fun time. I'm hoping to upload more of these videos, hopefully on a bi-weekly basis, but we're keeping it loose and free over here, so we'll see. And I'll catch you later.